I'm not the first coach to use that analogy, but if one half of the boat is rowing, the other half is, and I know I ask the kids, which way is the boat going? Well, it's going in circles, right? So uh, we're headed this way. You know, we this is what our goals are. This is what we're trying to do with this season, with this startup. So we need to row. We need to row. We have to agree on the framework. We got to set the framework, you know, and then you got to let the kids have you know, have freedom within that and, 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 and feel their oats and be the player they think they can be and bring what they can bring to the court and expand their game. You know, obviously maximizing strengths, minimizing, minimizing weaknesses in a game setting. But the bottom line is, you know, once we're rowing and we're moving in a certain direction as, as a group, you know, that's where then you want to start to, to get a return on those relationships, you know. And one of the things that helps you know, I, I'm a big believer and you don't know your relationship until it implodes. You know, confrontation is the first sign of success with people. You know, it's easy to say you have a relationship when everything's good, you know, but when your relationship implodes, now where is it? Now what kind of return can we get? Can we recalibrate it to get the return we wanted and envision, you know, between teammates, but then collectively as, as a program, as a group? And what helps with that, and this is what I say to the kids, what helps with that is in that moment, you can now look at the framework. You can look at the return on engagement. This is when you get the return on engagement, you know, because we've engaged the mission statement. We're moving in the right direction as a group. Again, not always perfect. We're all individuals first. You know, I never tell kids to lose their individuality. I think that's silly. You know, when you, when coaches bark at that, like we all played the game well before we thought we were going to be barked at by a, a mid 40, you know, 40 something year old coach. So we're all individuals, but then we have to understand, you know, what framework are we navigating? What's our mission? What's the goal of this group? And then that's where you kind of get to get everyone moving, hopefully in the right direction where, uh, you know, it just sets the table for hopefully a huge return on the relationships, relationships, the relationship with the game itself.